Hi everyone. Welcome to my channel. As you know, Blender 4.1 has been released with lots of updates. Blender 4.1 has introduced a new way for inserting animation keyframes for a simpler and more intuitive workflow. In this video, we'll learn the updated keying behavior, hotkeys, and keying options in Blender 4.1. As you know, in Blender 4.0 and earlier versions, we would press the I hotkey to add a keyframe while animating. This would open a menu showing the types of keyframes we could add. For example, select the torso, hit the I key, and add a location keyframe. So, the keyframes will be added only for X, Y, and Z location channels. Additionally, if you want to relocate and rotate the IK bone, select the location and rotation keyframes. So, X, Y, and Z rotation channels will also be added. Or, we can predefine which keys will be used from the active keying menu. When we press the I key, the Insert Keyframe menu won't be displayed anymore. The keyframes will be added directly based on the active keyframe. In Blender 4.1 has been a big change. When we press the I hotkey, the Insert Keyframe menu won't be displayed anymore. The keyframes will be added automatically. It will use the newly added options in the Preferences under the Animation tab. Go to the Edit menu, Preferences, and click on the Animation tab. Here the users can define which channels will be keyed. Let's select only the Location channel by default. When we hit the I key, the Location channels will only be added. We can also access the Insert Keyframe menu by pressing the K key in Blender 4.1, so we can add keyframes channels independently from the predefined keys in the Preferences. Additionally, we can skip the keyframes that don't affect the animation. As you can see, there are some orange lines between the keyframes. It means the animation channel doesn't change in this range. They are unnecessary keys we don't need to add. Go to the Animation tab in the Preferences and enable the Manual option. So, when we try to add the keyframes, it will skip the keyframes that don't affect the animation. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next tutorial.